Pal World, or should I say Pokemon with guns? When I heard about this, I couldn't tell but give it a try. As a huge Pokemon fan myself, the mere idea of a Pokemon using guns to shoot at other Pokemon and actually killing them is just mind-blowingly awesome. In addition to that, the price tag of only $30 made the decision very easy as well. Alright, we're gonna play hard because we are Giga Chats. Finish setting up and start, yes. <laughs> now, I wanna be a man. Why does only the body change? What about the face? Where's random? Oh, R. What the fuck is this? <laughs> She's thick, man. Holy. What the fuck is that? This guy's like bloated to the maximum. Holy sh Look at those fucking stilts. <laughs> oh my god. I kind of want to go with this guy, man. Can we get better hair, though? There we go. Okay, so this is our character. Why are the hands in his pockets? I don't know. Because he's cool. <laughs> oh, the game looks good. Oh wow, I can I can climb on this. Lol. Oh wow, I can climb everywhere, can I? Lol. Okay, so the tutorial is right here, but it doesn't tell me where to. Oh, look at that. Can I attack you? Am I dying? Or am I winning? I think I'm losing. Oh, I dodged! B Die! Oh, I don't have... No! <laughs> God damn it! Okay, so it tells me to go... <gasps> what is this? What? Who's this guy? Here, take some basic supplies. You need to tighten up if you want to survive out here. Guys, I got a stone. I think this is inefficient. Ooh, level up. You have unspent stat points. I guess we get HP because we need to survive. What? I get a hundred? Of course. Now, where do we... Oh, look at that. This looks like a good location for a camp. Okay. <laughs> That's a thick boy. If you are wet, you are slower. What, what was that? This is literally like Pokemon. Okay, I like this location. We're gonna build our camp here. Alright, so B. Workbench. Right here. We need a wooden club. Okay, like, uh, how? where's my equipment? What is this? Red berries, a versatile ingredient that is delicious, raw, or cooked. They can be found anywhere on the island. So these are basically... Can I put it here? Requires a small feedback. Okay. I also made myself a pickaxe and a stone axe, and then I was ready to gather some materials. The pickaxe was for stone, and the stone axe is for wood. Nice way of holding that thing. <laughs> uh, we need to go. Okay, so how do I switch weapons? Uh, so I tried pressing one and two, they didn't. Uh oh. I lost my pulse wear. Shit, I don't have a pulse wear left. Luckily, the tutorial told me exactly what to do. I had to open up my inventory and then switch into the technology tab. And this is where I found a bunch of recipes that I could unlock using points that you gain when leveling up. Are you sure you want to unlock it? Yeah. What is this? Facility for storing captured parts. Items. <gasps> a bow! Oh, I love bows! Wait, we need to sleep. Uh oh, I don't have wood and fiber and wool. Am I dying already? Hey, there's no way it goes down that quickly, bro. Come on. You little f <laughs> Okay, wait, again. <laughs> One more time. Kaboom! After spending a little bit too much time exploring and not worrying about the sun setting, I found myself in the darkness without fire or any shelter to protect me. Yeah. <laughs> it just rolls down the f <laughs> they are sleeping wait what happens ah, okay i'm cold literally like okay so like it's second ah, okay bro that's bullshit i'm hungry and cold oh no wait i need to eat Huh? Of course, me. Eat. All right. Um. Can I go through the night like this? I have wood. But I don't have wool. I wonder where... <gasps> I know how to get wool. I need to kill this guy here. Okay. Can we do a charge attack? Die! Boom! Ah, we got wool. See? Alright. We need a bed or something. Cloth. 
Okay, so we need cloth. We need one more. I wonder if they all attack me if I attack this guy. Hopefully not. <gasps> hey, I'm losing, I'm losing, I'm losing health. What the fuck, bro? I'm just murdering his friend right next to him. He doesn't care. Okay. Come on. Please. Dude, use the cloth, man. Bro is dying without a fire. Wait, can I make a fire? <gasps> Campfire. Okay, I, you just... I, it's, it's a little bit cheating. Wait, why can I not do the fire? Eh? I have the wood. Okay. Alright, come on. Come on! Oh. Oh, I can eat a fried egg. I'm fucking hungry now. <laughs> You should have been dead right now. Okay, bro. Stay mad, bitch. Can I take damage? Oh, no. Okay, I was taking damage. Oh, that was dumb. Oh, no. That was stupid. Hey, stop. Stop it. After surviving my first night effortlessly, I was ready to capture my first Pokey, I mean Pal. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna catch a Pokemon now. Yeah, and this is where I did my first classic mistake. I forgot to acquire my Pals. When do I capture them? Hey, I have Palsvius. Wait. Huh? I crafted. Oh no, I didn't pick them up, did I? Oh no. One second, bro. I need to pick up my, my spheres. So yeah, I had to do the walk of shame back to acquire my pal spheres. And then I could finally capture my very first pal. Oh. Uh-oh. It's two. Two against one. But I'm good. I'm a good gamer. Woo. All right. <laughs> My goodness! I'm gonna get you too, bitch. Seventy-three percent. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yay! I also captured myself the sheep and then it was time to build my very first base using the PAL box, which is used as a storage type of building that can act as a base somewhat center. Some of them now with E. Okay. Will he follow me? You're not gonna run through the fire, are you? Okay, how do I get you back? Oh, I see. And I can swap between them. I wonder how many you could have. Wait, I saw that earlier, earlier right? Pal deck. Aha, uh -huh. wow. You can have so many. No, is that the... P is that the Pokedex, guys? Is this the Pokedex? It's a Pal deck, totally different. <laughs> Alright, so the Pal box. Where do we put this? Oh yeah, I need to build it. Build it for me, bitch. Aren't they supposed to be slaves? Hey! Build this. Why do I have to build? What the fuck is that bar? The sheep can build, I think. The chickens are too dumb. Aha. Access the power box and summon a pal to your base. Summon a pal to your base. How do I do that? Oh, pal to... Okay. Alright, so this one is in my base now. Pals without beds will get stressed. Increase the player level by capturing 30 pals? What is this tutorial? Okay, wait. Is the axe good? Oh wow, it's actually really good. <laughs> Stupid. Fucking moron. Wait, I can't attack in water? Oh, my dude, my dude is helping me. I can't. It 
Lol, that's funny. This is something I also didn't know, of course. Different parts do different jobs. For example, the sheep is able to do handiwork, which means building stuff. And the chicken is mostly used for gathering and farming. How did I miss? <laughs> God damn it. Oh my god, I just wasted two balls, man. Uh... What does this uh, on the left mean? Plus six? Is that XP? <gasps> Lol, look at this guy. You see this big guy up there? What level is he? Is he friendly or will he attack me immediately? Lol, look at this guy. Look how fat he is. Damn. Where are you going? Seeing this big guy was definitely really cool, but I think it would have been much cooler if it actually attacked me or if there were some sort of pals that by nature are aggressive against humans. You know, some of the pals, I think it would make sense if they attack you by default. Now, I haven't fully played the game yet, so it could potentially be that that already exists and I just haven't seen that in the game yet. <gasps> what is this green thing? Collect it to mythology other than and offer them a statue of power to improve your ability to capture. Cool. Where is my pal? Bro. This is one annoying thing about the game that is going to happen a lot. Pals can get stuck. For example, in my situation here, my pal got stuck in the river while fighting another pal. And then it couldn't get out of it again, which means that it wouldn't do any jobs around the base. The only thing that can unstuck them again then is to put them out and in the base again. So basically they respawn after that. Work for me, bitch. It's working for me! I have to do nothing! Oh God! My weapon is damaged though. How do I repair? A repair bench. Oh, I see. I need wood for that. Okay. <laughs> I keep tossing those fucking balls. <laughs> I don't know why. It's it be it's because it's on cue. <laughs> no! I'm not doing this on purpose. I wanted to press W, but then I accidentally clicked on Q. On Q. I fat fingered, I'm sorry. At this point, I probably should mention that this is actually my first survival game, so the tech tree or whatever you want to call it in PAL world looks quite nice. And I really like the way you can level up and then spend your level up points into the tech tree and decide which structure you want to get next. Hanging trap. Catches parts that pass through, only effective on small parts and humans. That's too good not to do. And also depending on which parts you have already unlocked, aka captured, you unlock additional buildings in this tech tree that you can unlock using points. Security settings? <laughs> Is this a router or something? <laughs> Lol, who's this? Hello? I've got some good items in stock. Bye. I have no gold. Okay, so this guy sells some... Wait, it costs 120 to buy one of those? And he gives us a tenth of the price. Okay, what is this? Unlock fast travel. Oh, nice. Okay, where are the Lambert's though? I can't complete the fucking mission because there are no... Per no, no... I was put him... Uh, foot, foot. These monsters, the Poke. The, 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 no, I just tossed the ball. Fuck. God damn it. I pressed the wrong button. Okay, we found one. What the fuck did you do that? <laughs> I'm just gonna unequip this guy. Come back. Come back. Press four. Thank you very much. Oh, look at that. So many. <gasps> oh, yeah. Come here. No. Ooh. 
good. Mm -hmm. Finally. <laughs> Where the fuck are you? Good. Uh, by the way, it's this option right here. The aim sensitivity, that's gonna be like, I don't know, four to, four to five times higher. At least three. View base, base upgrade. Maximum pulse working at base. Go to two, maximum number of bases. And build a shoddy bed. I can't see anything, God damn it! Next, it was time to gather some more resources so I could upgrade my equipment because I wanted to go out and capture a couple more pals that are higher level than those level 1 and level 2s that I've been capturing so far. <laughs> what the fuck is that? How are you holding the spear, bro? There must be a bug. All right, I gotta deal a lot of damage now, right? Holy shit, 200 damage. It's like I'm totally useless and the chicken's doing all the work. Chicken, kill him. No! Wait, the following parts were dropped? This really is like Fortnite, isn't it? You just get everything, bro. Take all. Why is it on X? What is this? Lift? I can toss him? Huh? How, how do I... How do I... I can't get it away from me! <laughs> Press F? No work available? Oh, I see. <laughs> After that, I started focusing more on the base building aspect or survival aspect of PAL world, which was, you know, to build up your base, get more PALs into your base so they work for you and you generate resources while you're not even in the base. And again, as I said before, this took a little bit of time because, yeah, PAL world is actually my first survival game. And so, yeah, for me, all of these survival mechanics were new, while I'm pretty sure some of you have already seen them in other games before. Nonetheless, it was really cool cool to see how the parts work for you while you just stand there and order them around if they work that is you come here go right here okay do it <laughs> i told you to go to the copper ore man not the bush what are you doing Huh? Come back here. Go. <laughs> he doesn't want to do it. <gasps> this guy's scary. I want to have a new Pokemon. Whoa! <laughs> Wait. Jump on it. No. No. I have no more parts. <laughs> Look at this raid. What the? They're destroying everything. Kaboom! I'm cooking Lambel kebab. And I'm literally having Lambels right next to me. I'm cooking their brothers. Guys, I deal no damage. This spear is weak. Now that I know a little bit more about the game, I actually deal no damage because of the difficulty that I chose, because it makes me deal four times less damage than in the previous difficulty, which I think is way too little damage to compare myself to the other pals, because they deal 200 damage while I sit around and deal 20, which I think is unfair and makes myself really useless compared to the parts which are overpowered. <laughs> Look at this chicken man. I'm eating and I see this one is being hungry man. <laughs> you think you're getting something bro? Hell no. <laughs> Hmm. Offer lift monk effigies to enhance your capture power. Oh, yeah. Oh, can I capture you too? People told me I can capture people. I wonder if I can attack him. 
Why am I not taking bank? Why can't you just mention? Come on. <gasps> I have a merchant! Lol, what happened now? Party. Merchant. Humans are not pals, therefore they do not possess partner skills. Raid? Oh, on the top here. Wait, I wanna catch one of those. Dire Howl. Thirty damage? Oh wow, that's a lot. I can't see anything. Woo! Oh wow! Damn! Fuck. Oh no! Yes. 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 Oh, yes. Case you can dodge with control. Oh, I didn't know that. I lost one of my Pokemon, though. When it reaches zero, its strength is exhausted and it is incap incap inca incapacitated. Place an incapacitated pail in a pail box to restore itself. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, what what are you doing? <laughs> it's like trying to climb the house. <laughs> Look at this! It's like trying to climb the the ceiling. Let's go explore and uh, level up a little bit. We also need to collect some. Pa Wait, how do me? How many balls do I have? How can I see my balls? <laughs> Guys, where's my balls? I have no balls. <laughs> and we need to get some more. What is this sound? Is this the Pokemon here? Lol, what is this? Ah, oh, <laughs> That's a shiny Pokemon, right? It's a shiny Akka. <laughs> I don't have a Pokeball! No! Wait! Don't attack! Please stop! I need a Pokeball! <laughs> Wrong fucking button! Go away! <laughs> God damn it. Okay, I can get three. Come on. Hurry up. Okay, the, the AI is stupid. I can't get too close to the camp because my other Pokemans will attack it. <laughs> I can already see it. No! Come on! Please! Yes! It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. No! Fuck! I was having a shiny Pokemon, man, and I lost it. It's like, you know, when you find one of the rare Pokemons in the original game and it just flees. I knew this was gonna happen, you know? I can catch 10%, but 70%? Hell nah. Like, there's way... It wasn't even 70%. I lost him on 80%. How do you lose on 80%? You don't. You know, it's gotta be uh, one of those chances like an XCOM. Where they tell you that it's 50%, but in actuality, it's actually only 40%. Oh, yo, 80%? Nah, bruh, it's, it's not 80%, bruh. Uh, you, you think it's 80%? <laughs>
<laughs> you idiot. To ease my frustration, I went on exploring a little bit to capture a couple of piles, but instead I actually wasted a couple of my spheres, like always. I keep throwing those balls, man! Stop! Oh, and I also found these interesting looking eggs. One of them was green and the other one was normal rarity. So it, to me, it looks like this world is not randomly generated. Is it correct? Did they actually handcraft this world? It does make sense because then you can allow for a proper progression in the world. Baseball bat. How much damage is it? This is one thing that irks Come me a little on, bit then. about the game, and I think it should be fixed quite fast. The targeting sometimes is so annoying that even if you're standing right in front of something, you just won't activate it. 50 damage? I need a water Pokemon. Oh, wow, look at that green one. We're getting this one. What level are you? Yeah. Uh-oh, level 15. Oh, no! Uh oh. Um, um, um. What? He, he wasn't even facing me. Oh, God. Oh, God. Run. Ah. What the f? What is this attack? Bitch. Hey, I can't move! <laughs> oh. oh. Uh oh. Oh no. Ah! Oh my god. Ooh. I can't, I can't, I can't fucking... Yeah? Yeah? You fucking dumbass. We have to be very careful here not to kill it. 5%. Oh! oh. Ah. 18! Come on! Oh. Come on, please! Twenty percent. I can't. Oh! God damn it! How many balls do I have left? One ball. One ball. Come on, man. Please, please. Fifty percent. Yo! Oh my God! <laughs> I got it! On the last one! Yeah. Oh wow! Look at this big one! It's planting! <gasps> Ooh, it's planting! Lol! Oh, those are the ones that can log wood? 
<gasps> I knew this! Bandwagon fan gods? What the f is that? No, they're all recovering! But I have this level 8 guy. There's no way. They have no chance. Uh oh. Holy shit! Hey! Attack, you dumbass! Oh, I'm out of. Ouch. Okay, wait, that was easy. King of the forest, level 38. 4000 HP, yeah, how about we... We do that later, okay? Oh, I have unspent skill points. I don't understand. Why is it not 110? Yeah, for example, stamina, 110. Huge increase, but attack is only 102. But I'm thinking about it like this. If 100 is the base value and you get 2, that is literally a 2% increase in something. And then if I take stamina and I increase that by 10... That is a 10% increase. Like, uh, I don't understand to why that percentage value is such... So different. This guy eats like a fat ass. Food. Holy shit, look how much food this guy needs. You fat ass. Stop eating all the food. Holy shit, he's thicker than me. Actually, though, if you compare the legs... I think I'm almost as thick as this guy. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs>